Tactical urbanism is the use of short-term, low-cost uh, demonstration projects to showcase what's possible in neighborhoods. The graffiti artist in you. Oh yeah, definitely. That's me, all right. So we use a lot of borrowed materials, temporary materials, and work with community groups to to transform their neighborhoods and their streets um, for say one day, or say a week, or even a month uh, to showcase what's possible. You're gonna write your big idea, and you're gonna write your first step. This is like such a huge project because it'll slow down, uh, it'll slow down all the traffic in here. So it'll be really nice. I think uh, having parking spaces in front and having yeah. tables out in front of here will really slow things down. Uh, want to block off this area here? I'm not the guy. We're just waiting for the paint to dry. I came up here to the area for my husband's job almost a couple years ago and um, I've been nervous to cross this intersection with my two kids. We want to slow the traffic down and we want to um, create a shorter crosswalk. Being um, physically involved definitely makes me feel more invested. on-street parking like we did over there, only there'll be two spaces, and instead of putting cars here, we'll fill it with the parklet. Space for people to sit, rest, have coffee, read the newspaper, hang out. you to come out and walk, bike, go to the local businesses, ask questions, uh, get involved, and advocate for a safer Islington Street moving forward. And we hope this is just a start. You know, this is one project. There's been a ton of volunteer time. PS21 has been great in ushering this through, but it'd be really wonderful to have this process be something that other groups can do and other neighborhoods can do and other businesses can do moving forward in Portsmouth. So we're kind of the guinea pigs and, and, and are excited about the outcomes uh, in the future. So thank you.